What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Rich Nice back once again. So today we're back on the uh, C10 project and today we're going to hook up our reverse lights and our neutral safety switch. Um, normally you would have a neutral safety switch that looks something like this that's down underneath um, on the column inside and your reverse lights and your neutral safety switch would go there but with our painless harness that one is not working well with our harness so I decided to uh, use the one for our 4L60E for our 5.3 uh, so the first thing you have to do is pull the pigtail off of the uh, driver's side of the transmission underneath um, and then we'll pull that out bring it up here and I'll show you what it looks like and we'll go from there Dark side, light this bitch up. Using for our particular uh, 4L60E, <coughs> ours is a third gen, um, and our transmission has the one big single plug versus the two smaller plugs. So um, we'll be using pin one, pin 10, pin 11, and pin 12. Uh, so I've already hooked up my reverse lights. So with the reverse lights, <coughs> right here it will be your green your dark green light green that come from your painless harness or inside of your cab to a light green goes to your light green your dark green goes to this orange looking brownish color so then we'll use pin one and pin um, 12 to hook our starter up, but you will need a relay. So let me go grab that. All right, YouTube, we have our relay. It's a four pin relay. You have red, black, blue, and uh, white. So blue is 87, black is 85, or uh, yeah, 85. And then red is 30 and white is 86. So our red wire, our 30, will go to the purple wire that's coming out of our harness right here. That purple wire. And what I did was I just cut the purple wire that goes to the starter. So this right here goes all the way down around into the starter. Um, <clears throat> Now, if you don't want a neutral safety switch, because basically all a neutral safety switch does, if you ever had a manual transmission and you have it in gear and you go to start it and your emergency brake on and your clutch ain't in, it's going to jump. And this will do the same thing for automatic. As soon as you start turning that over, it's going to start jumping on you and moving. So this prevents that. So <clears throat> um, our red wire will go to our purple wire coming out of the harness our um, 86 our white wire will go to our pin one and this is the pigtail for the neutral safety switch I just took the cover off so you can actually see the wires um, so one is at the top and 12 is at the bottom so we'll need this pink wire right here and we'll need this dark green wire up top. So our white wire will go to this pink wire. Our 87 will go to the starter. So the blue wire will go to the starter. 
and 85 will go to ground and 30 will go to pin 12 and to the purple wire so let's get this wired up and uh see what kind of trouble we can get in all right youtube we got our wire set up we got our green wire uh which is our number one pin at the very top dark green it is going to our white wire which will go to 86 our pin 12 will be spliced and it will go to the 30 on the relay and the pink wire coming from the ignition or the purple wire coming from the ignition black will go to ground and then blue will go to our purple wire is going to our starter so I will get this put back together uh, and show you what that looks like all right YouTube we got our cover back on uh, so what I'll do is I'll go and plug this back into the uh, neutral safety switch that's on the transmission and basically it plugs in just like this and then you push this little piece up to lock it in place plugs in just like this then you'll push this little piece right here up like this and it'll lock into place so uh, and that'll pull it snug and keep it from leaking and getting water and all that good stuff in it so I'll run back down and plug this back in and then we'll be back all right YouTube we got our relay in it's mounted right here because it's out of the way we have our uh, blue wire which is our pin 87 that goes down to our starter uh, now don't worry I'll get these wires cleaned up we have our red wire which is a uh, 30 on our relay and it goes over here and connects to our purple wire that comes from our ignition and goes down to pin uh, 12 on our transmission this white wire goes to pin one and it comes up here and goes to the white wire here which is pin 86 and then we have uh, you really can't see it but we have two grounds we have one ground here and then we have another ground underneath here where the uh, horn is so uh, it's grounded so the only thing for us to do now is come in here and test this out so first thing we're going to do is see if our reverse lights work uh, if it does get a little loud it's because it's the compression for the airbags so we're going to shift into reverse and you can see our reverse lights work we shift out and you can see the ball now <coughs> Come in here and we'll see if we can start this thing. That's reverse. So with the neutral safety switch, if we shift it to anything but park or neutral, this truck should not start, which will prevent it from jumping and it's a safety feature. So uh, we'll shift it into neutral. Actually, we'll turn it on. Shift it into reverse. See if we can. As you can see, I'm turning the key. Nothing. We will shift it back into park. I should be able to turn the key. And just like that, that's how you uh, install your neutral safety switch and your reverse lights if your column neutral safety switch is not working on these trucks so again i have a painless harness and that part number is 10206 is what i believe it is uh, don't quote me on it and i'm sure if, uh, if i'm wrong you'll tell me in the comments so i will continue getting these wires cleaned up and we'll call this one done so on to the next project as always thank you for hanging around uh one more thing to check off on the list on this stupid truck <laughs> as we get it uh ready to hit the road uh, again if you have any questions concerns or comments just leave them in down below and until next time 
Peace. Here is the part number for the factory neutral safety switch. And I will also leave a, uh, the part number for the uh, 4L60E neutral safety switch that you can get off Amazon in the description below.